Okay. This is a water system wrench. These are available at Easton Wind Water. It's got a fork on the end. That fork goes in this water system cap to open it. That cap is right by the hydrant, right by the doorway. It's got a slot that engages an operating rod. When this is installed, you take the cap off and engage the wrench. When the wrench faces that valve box, the water system is open. So step one is gonna be take that cap off. You're gonna close this water system. When you close it, it's gonna turn that way. So just, you don't have to force it. Um, just gent, it'll operate gently. So just turn it and you'll figure out which way it goes. I believe off is counterclockwise. So it's gonna go across. When you close this, it opens up a drain down below grade and lets the water start to drain back. So your first step, do that. Leave the wrench right in the hole in the off position. Your next step is gonna be to open this cover up. Locate that valve, turn that to the off position. Off position is 90 degrees to the hose. Someone's hunting in the wheat. When it's 90 degrees to the pipe, it's off. You need an air compressor and this fitting. You can make this fitting up at stuff from Fernandes Hardware. It's just a female faucet adapter to an airline. You're gonna hook up your air compressor to any faucet. I like this one, it's close. So hook this up, hook an airline to it, open the faucet. Sequentially go around and open each faucet until all the water comes out. It's gonna take a little while, depends on the size of your compressor. Irrigation guys do this all the time. So. Once they blow all of this out, go around, close every faucet except for this one. Leave your air compressor hooked up. The last thing you're gonna do is open this valve back up and you're gonna see air and water blow out of the water service valve. That means you're blowing this line all the way back to the water service valve. When you've got, when it sounds like you've got just air coming out of there, Go ahead, disconnect your airline. Turn this water service back on. Make sure this valve is open. Go around, open all of the faucets, leave them open for the winter. When you come in the springtime, the water department will turn on the water service and water will flow out the faucets. There's nothing to be turned back on on this property. Everything should be left in the on position, including that valve.